Hey, 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 hey. I'm dropping in real quick today with some limited edition snacks from Whole Foods. And they just stay taking my whole entire paycheck. These are the white chocolate gingerbread bark limited edition. And the s'mores bites also limited edition. But I'm concerned already because white chocolate gingerbread bark does not sound like my thing. I like white chocolate, but gingerbread, I'm not that crazy about. We're gonna try it. This does not give a description, so I'm just gonna have to go based on the picture, which I'm assuming is white chocolate topped with crumbled gingerbread cookies and s'mores bites. I'm not a s'mores person. I don't know why. I like graham crackers, I like chocolate. Okay, maybe it's the marshmallows. I'm not really a marshmallow person, but I do like roasted, fresh roasted, hot roasted, melted marshmallow. But the whole s'mores thing just does not appeal to me. And this appears to be graham cracker topped with a huge marshmallow piece and covered in chocolate. But it says, s'mores bites, crunchy cookie and marshmallow enrobed in semi-sweet chocolate. And again, this is white chocolate gingerbread bark. That's all it says. No description. Let's go. We'll do the white chocolate gingerbread bark first. It's probably less jarring than the s'mores bites. Ooh, it has a good smell though. I like the smell. It's very holiday-ish. Or you could just like have this as an aroma in your house. Is aroma size a word? If not, can we make it one? I kind of like that aroma size. These are big pieces though. Look at that. That's humongous, as I thought. It's just a slab of white chocolate with, that doesn't even look like gingerbread cookie, but I'm gonna assume it's gingerbread cookie just mixed on top. Just placed on top, not even mixed, just splattered on top. Oh, did I just do that on camera? Oops. Okay, so I'll just go with, no, I don't want this piece though. I want something smaller. I'm like, they at least could have mixed in the pieces of gingerbread or whatever this is. This is just trifling. No razzle, no dazzle, no sparkle, no pizzazz. It's literally just white chocolate with graham cracker. I'm assuming cookie, I don't know. I'm not graham cracker. Um, gingerbread. I'm assuming cookie. Just on top. That's it, that's all. Like, they're just taking people's money for no reason. <laughs> There's nothing special about that. <laughs> No pop, just that. It probably would have been better to do like an eggnog flavored white chocolate on top of a gingerbread cookie. Y'all know I'm mad because that was like five dollars, right? Five whole dollars out of my money. I really don't want to try these s'mores bites, especially after the whole white chocolate gingerbread park fiasco, but we gotta do it. Y'all owe me a thank you or something. And if you hear that noise, I apologize. It's like almost 2 a.m. on a Sunday night or a Monday morning. And it's New York City. That's a trash truck. Never any peace and quiet in this city. But back to these s'mores bites. Oh, they are big. And this is mostly marshmallow. I can already tell. This is, mm -mm. Not gonna be good. The bag smells like Almond Joy though, which is a nice smell. Is this dark chocolate? Oh, semi-sweet chocolate. Here we go. Mm-mm. Oh.
I want all my money back. This too was five dollars. Mm -mm. The semi sweet chocolate, it gives what it gives. Semi sweet chocolate. The marshmallow is gross. One is too much of it. And then this cookie is just what it is a cookie, a nondescript cookie. It's not graham cracker, it's a cookie. That's what it is. All that marshmallow, that nondescript cookie, is bland. They could have at least used graham cracker of some sort. Horrible, $5. Down the drain. They are wrong for this. Ew. I'm so through. Oh my goodness. Those were the s'mores bites and the white chocolate gingerbread bark from Whole Foods. Limited edition snacks for the year of 2022. They could have kept those. Both of those. So horrible. If you see those while you're walking through the store, walk on by. Pretend you are Dionne Warwick and walk on by. Don't stop. Don't try. Just walk on by. But if you have been following along with the channel and you've seen the community post, and if you haven't, after this video will be a good time to run on over there and see those community posts that I've been putting up so we can like communicate, chit chat, bond. But back to what I was originally saying. Then you have seen posts for the caramel apple cups. And baby, when I tell you these are delicious, that's an understatement. These are absolutely freaking lutely delicious. Whew. Dark chocolate caramel apple cups. Mini dark chocolate cups filled with apple flavored almond butter and caramel. When I tell you, these are also $5, but worth it. These are so tasty, they like melt in your mouth. If you see these, stop, try, get your life together, buy a bag, and try these. But also, let me know where you find them. Of course, it's a Whole Foods, duh. But, like Whole Foods, where? Feel free to drop me the whole entire address because I can't find them anymore near me. They're like gone 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 I'm like can y'all bring these back can y'all keep these on the shelf year round because yes i'm raving reviewing multiple starring these dark chocolate caramel apple cups Woo! yes that's all i have to say but thank you for tuning in to this episode i will see you next time until then stay tasting and stay testing Bye-bye now.